first way, there's one, uh, quite a few resets. So if something's not working right, here's a couple resets. One way is holding down the select button and the back button. Let's go ahead and hold that down. And count about basically 15 seconds. And five, four, three, and then that's a reset right there. And here's another reset. You shut down and hold that button. Turn back on. And let's go ahead and click on that and go all the way down to actually let's do all settings and go all the way down to factory reset and right here and click on that and that's how you reset that so these are the different resets you could do on your smartwatch and I'll show you how to connect uh, your Bluetooth to your phone if you ever lose uh, your Bluetooth connection which is pretty rare um, but I'm going to show you how to do it anyway so the only thing you would have to do is go ahead and go in your settings Right there, your Bluetooth. Okay, make sure it is on. You can cycle it on and off. That's how, go ahead and reset that. Then, and here, let's go ahead and make sure your Bluetooth is on right here as well. You can cycle it, just do like a, you know, soft cycle. And go to your Pebble app. Get started and put them right next to each other and see if they connect. Okay, now it found it. Go ahead and click on Pebble. This is connected. Okay. Test it. And then you get to hit next. And I'm going to, so that's how you connect your uh, Pebble. Now, if you want to connect to a new device, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So let's go ahead and connect to a new device. Hit back, back. Okay. Go down. Click on that. Forget it. Click on Bluetooth. Right there, click on pair and then click on check mark right there. It should be connected. You can confirm that in your Pebble app. Go ahead, click to connect, and it says connected. Right there, it says connected. See? And you can test it. Just like that. Now, if this does not work, you go restart your phone, turn your phone off, and hit restart. Hit OK. And you can do the same thing on your on your watch. So let's go ahead and try that. Hit that button, go down to settings, hit settings, and you can do shut down. Now if it's really messed up, messed up, you could do factory reset, but always start off with doing a regular shutdown. And then boot it back up. And that's how you do it. And uh, just hit back, and then you should be back to where your main screen is. And mine tells me my weather, uh, date and time, and my battery life percentage on my phone. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and check out my other YouTube videos, how to fix tablets and computers and TVs.